Hey everybody, this is Guru Francis, Big Boy Scream and today is another FMA tutorial. And today we're going to talk about clinch fighting. But before we do that, please don't forget to click like, share, and subscribe, and not no notification button so that you are up to date with every every one of our latest videos. So today we're going to talk about clinch fighting. Now I was watching a video about this Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu expert, and he was talking about like how in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, everybody always says that the, that every fight ends up on the ground. I necessarily don't actually you know uh, adhere to that 100. percent I do believe that it is possible to get to the ground, but it doesn't always do that. But one of the other things that he mentioned that it like most all fight most of all fights end up in a clinch. So then now one of the biggest proponent again proponent of Filipino martial arts is how do we fight uh, in close range in a clinch mode while doing a Filipino while using a stick. So today we're going to be demonstrating how we fight as an FMA Escrimador in a clinch. So I have my student Gene here. <laughs> come here, you have to come closer. So Gene here to to help me demonstrate the movement. Now in a clinch fighting, as we know, clinch fighting is when right foot forward. Come closer. Is that when we're up when we're this tight tight close? So we could be grabbing the shirt. She could be you know we could we we could be pushing against each other. That's what mo for the most part for now. That's the clinch. Now in the wrestling clinch, it would be here. But I don't. But just for now, for the demonstration, the clinch is here. Now how do we then now? fight with a with a solid 28 inch stick with a clinch so now G, what Jean's going to demonstrate slowly and not without any pain for me is how she's going to roll and um and hit me and create the space that she needs to be able to de to, to execute the move so go ahead and it's right boom okay one more time she's going to lean towards me she go right foot forward again okay, she's right foot forward again it's okay and turn and strike Boom. Okay. So now what we're going to be demonstrating is again, how is that effective? And now we're going to get the shield. And I'm going to be holding it for her as she execute this move. So stop for one second. Let me explain. Okay. So now just to make it more realistic, she's going to be pushing forward and I'm going to be pushing forward so that, uh, so that um, we, there's some pressure into that. So when she pushes forward, push, 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 and turn and strike. Good. One more time. Push, 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 and turn. Good. So as you notice, that when she, she's creating the space for herself. Now, ultimately, that is a lot of space that she's occupying, and I'm always a very strong proponent of, you know, fighting in this as, most, as confined space as possible. So now she's going to still do the turn, but she's not going to turn as big. Turn and strike, strike. Okay? Again, now go all the way through. Turn and strike. Good. Okay. So that's how she does it. Now let's do this on the other side. Okay. Push, 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 and turn. Go all the way through, please. Push, push, and turn. Good. All the way through. Push, 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 and go. Good. Swing all the way through, Gene. Push, push, and turn. Good. So that's how. And then so now we're going to be. Here's some clips of her doing this without uh, just by herself so you can see the footwork but that's how we fight in the clinch so until then this is Guru Francis Big Boy Screamador peace out God bless and keep swinging them sticks